Good Thoughts from Vision's Daily Devotion, The Word for Today. Ecclesiastes 3 verse 1. There is a time for everything and a season for every activity under the heavens. The Word for Today is the third in our series on why we resist change. What happens when you try to implement change at the wrong time? For that matter, when is the right time to do it? From a leadership perspective, there are actually better times than others to make changes. Dr. John Maxwell, who wrote the bestseller, The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership, says, I developed the following checklist to help me navigate the process. Will this change benefit the followers? Is it compatible with the purposes of the organisation? Is this change specific and clear? Are the top 20%, the influencers, in favour of it? Is it possible to test this change before making a total commitment to it? Are physical, financial and human resources available to make this change? Is it reversible? Is this change the next obvious step? Does it have both short and long-term benefits? Is the leadership capable of bringing about this change? Does everything else indicate the timing is right? He says before implementing a big change, he runs through this checklist and answers each question with a yes or no. If too many questions have a no beside them, then he concludes that the timing may not be right. Timing is so important. The Bible says in Ecclesiastes 3 verse 1 and 11, There is a time for everything and a season for every activity under the heavens. He has made everything beautiful in its time. If you're thinking of making a change, Talk to God, the timekeeper, and ask him, what should I do? And when should I do it? And then step out in faith and trust him to guide you. Why We Resist Change, Part 3. That's Vision's Word for Today. The Word for Today, Australia's most widely read daily devotion. Read it, share it or subscribe. Free at vision.org.au or in the Vision app. Just another way Vision is helping you look to God daily.